Hey guys, and welcome back to Hope Kids. I'm Kelsey. And I'm Shani. And we're so excited to hang out with you guys today. Before we get started, we wanted to give you guys the memory verse for today. It comes from the same Bible story that we talked about on Sunday. The Bible verse goes like this. God will provide a sheep for the burnt offering. And Shani, where can they find this Bible verse? In Genesis 22, 8. That is correct. Awesome. So now we've got a little bit of a puzzle just to help you guys memorize the verse. Let's take a look at that. So the way that you do this puzzle is you write out the memory verse on a piece of paper. Then you cut it up into smaller pieces and scatter them around and see how quickly you can put it together. All right, so the next game we're gonna play is called Pin the Ram on the Altar. Here's the things that you guys are gonna need to play this game. You're gonna need a picture of an altar that you can print at home or you can just draw on yourselves. We drew ours. And then you're just gonna take some little pieces of sticky tack and you're just gonna put them right on the back four corners of the paper. Then you're just gonna stick it behind you to somewhere on the wall, your fridge, wherever seems good. The next thing you're gonna need is gonna be a little ram from the craft that we made on Sunday. Here's ours. And then just something to cover the eyes of the person that's playing. All right, you guys ready? All right. So, I've got Shenny blindfolded now, and she is ready to pin the ram onto the altar. So Shenny, if you want to put out your hand, I'm going to give our ram to you. And try and get it as close as you can to the altar. Oh, that's not too bad. Take a look, see how you did. Oh, wow. Not too bad. <laughs> All right guys, so this is the last game that we have for you today. Now this game is called Stop and Go. And this game is about like how Abraham obeyed God. It's about our obedience. So just in the same way that Abraham waited when God said stop and he moved when God said go, that's exactly what Shenny and Laura are gonna do as they play this game today with me. So the game goes like this. When I tell them to go, they're gonna start hopping towards me. When I tell them to stop, they have to freeze. And if somebody moves when it's time for them to freeze, that means that they're out and they didn't win the game. I'm going to put my hands like this, and the first person to touch my hand is the winner. Shani and Laura, are you guys ready? Yes. yes. All right, go. Stop. Stop. Go. Oh, I think it was a tie. Well done, guys. <laughs> we have two winners amongst us today. Yes. Shani and Laura, well done, guys. All right, well that's all we've got for you guys today. Thank you so much for joining us. We had such a good time hanging out with you. Yeah, we did. Mm -hmm. So we'll be back next week at the exact same time, Thursday at 4.30. We'll see you then. Bye.